we have made it to the hotel safe and sound i am so excited this is my first trip like business trip for my own company so that is very exciting because up until now i've been a tourist party for like companies i work for but this is for me and it is so cute i'm in like this boutique hotel the view is like die for and it's a super beautiful day i'm just so happy i can't wait to get it going with my day we're gonna go eat we're gonna go shopping and we're going to create some content it's going to be super super fun and tomorrow we're going to go to barcelona and then i'm gonna spend the weekend in barcelona because paris is very rainy right now it doesn't feel like summer <laughs> So I just, you know, once I'm in Spain, why would I go back? <laughs> I'm just going to stay here uh, until Monday. And I, you know, took this opportunity to tell my boyfriend to come here. And after I'm done working, we're going to do a couple of days of vacation. So that's going to be fun. So I just had a lovely meal with some lovely people and now I'm just gonna walk around and I'm very full so we have to be at the lobby at 4 to go and work uh, which is just basically content creation around this shopping mall that we're like promoting so that's gonna be super fun so for now I'm just walking around Madrid I'm really enjoying it because it's hot but it's not like crazy hot and I'm also like in the shade so that's pretty nice it actually is so beautiful I didn't expect it to be like so grand in terms of like architecture and stuff it reminds me a little of Paris which I did not expect I'm in like my main character moment I'm just listening to music and like feeling like the main freaking character around Madrid what mask situation is like here I am gonna have to research it on the internet but oh, it's very hot so um, there's no one around I just took to just take a breath but I'm honestly absolutely surprised on how beautiful this city is not that I thought it wasn't beautiful but I didn't know it was like this beautiful. <laughs> I think that I don't know in Latin America I don't think you know what, I'm gonna speak for myself. Since Spain colonized Latin America, I am not very fond of Spain, but it was a long time ago, so I'm just gonna let it go <laughs> and enjoy this beautiful city. Even though I'm only here for one day, I'm going to be spending more time in Barcelona. Uh, I can already say that I probably like Madrid better just because of the architecture, like, look at this. That's very Parisian, love that. See, see everybody over, like there's like a park, everyone has a dog and I'm really, really considering getting a dog. I really want a dog. My boyfriend doesn't really care for dogs. They are a big responsibility and they take a lot of time to take care of and stuff. So I don't know that that is a good idea at the moment because for example, today probably I couldn't, like I don't know what I would have done with the dog because I can just leave and leave him or her, you know, in the apartment with like no one to take him or her out. So I don't know, I guess I can dream, but they're so cute. I've always had dogs always when I was little and stuff. So anyways, I'll think about it as I walk through Madrid. So, so cute. I'm so happy. Oh my 
my boyfriend's not with me tonight i can't show you the behind the scenes because he's normally the one that is like filming the whole thing but i just did like a photo shoot in that bar with a huge flash the background is amazing but absolutely everyone was looking at me honestly being like a content creator you learn to just not be ashamed or anything like right here i'm just talking to a phone everyone looks at me weird but you know what i don't care <laughs> these people are not going to remember me in like five minutes so why should i care i'm gonna go do my shopping and hopefully find something nice because i only have like 30 minutes left before this stores close so let's go and find something nice success Yay! I got them in blue because I feel like everyone has the black spatterings and I don't know if it's like it's cuter for summer but honestly I normally don't make I don't like making decisions in like under pressure and the store was closing and I'm leaving today in Madrid so I just had to you know make hard choices but I think I I think I nailed it. So now we're just going to go back to the hotel and tomorrow we're going to go and do the same in Barcelona. I was dying of thirst. Oh my God, I can't wait to just sleep. But tomorrow we have, we're taking the train to Barcelona um, at nine. So that's gonna be fun. Honestly, I am so surprised by how beautiful Madrid is. Like, I knew it was beautiful, but I feel like it's a little bit like Rome, you know? With like all the grandeur and the architecture. And the food is chef's kiss. So now I'm gonna go to sleep. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Bye. Good morning. I am all ready. We're gonna go get breakfast we have the train to Barcelona at like 9 30 and my boyfriend is arriving today to Barcelona so it's nice which is like this outside shopping mall so beautiful it's like the perfect weather it's sunny but it's not super hot I am all ready to do my shopping so we're gonna go and eat and then we're gonna do that I have had such a crazy day, but this is the perfect end to it. I didn't even take out my phone today because with the shopping and the creating the content and stuff, it was just not possible. But I got a little um, wallet from Gucci, which was nice. And we created some content to post on Instagram and TikTok for the brand. So that's cool. And now we're just taking a little swim before going to the restaurant, honestly. Look at this view. We have the Sagrada Familia right here.
has been such a long day, so honestly, there's nothing that's gonna make me happier than to go to the spa right now. Honestly, it's super hot outside, so I'm like, I don't even wanna go outside. This is the perfect way to be right now. Today is my last day in Barcelona. Honestly, it has been so great. We're just gonna do a little breakfast at the hotel and then we're gonna go to the beach to film some TikToks and then we're going to go back to the airport. And yeah, overall, we've had like an amazing experience. We've just, you know, taken it hour by hour to enjoy every possible moment, but we're very happy to be here and the whole pandemic situation is getting worse by the day so we're like a little i don't want to say happy but like luckily that we got to do this trip before going back to possible lockdown so that's good news for us shows you just how prepared I was for being in the beach. I'm not a beach person, I really am not. But anyways, it's such a cute day. We are in the nudist beach, which we found out, you know, the hard way. But uh, it's kind of fun, I guess. It's really funny. Uh, it's interesting to see people so like, secure in their own bodies. Uh, it definitely gives me more confidence. But um, yeah, definitely has been a very interesting beach trip. And now we're drying up and we're gonna probably go and grab something to eat. That's it. We are back in the city. We're going to grab something to eat and then we're going to take the car to the airport to take it back to Paris. Uh, but not before eating something very yummy. 